Hi, my name is Celia Fortinsky and I'm a senior at Quinnipiac University. I'm currently in the entry level master's program for occupational therapy. This means that in this spring, in May of 2010, I'll graduate with a bachelor's degree in health science and then move on to receive a master's degree in occupational therapy after an additional year and a half. I absolutely love babysitting and love being with children and have done this throughout the past seven years of experience. I love taking what I learn in class um, in my occupational therapy courses and applying it to children when I'm, I'm watching them and babysitting them. We learn that play is extremely important, um, especially for children these days in a very disciplined world, so I really like to see what is meaningful to the child, what they like to do, and help incorporate that along with helping with homework. I like making a fun environment for the children, and I think that this really helps form a bond with the children when I watch them. I think that I'm a very qualified babysitter. I've had clinical experience through um, Quinnipiac in the occupational therapy program with children who are typically developing as well as children who have developmental or psychological impairments. I've worked with children with ADD, ADHD, conduct disorder, Asperger's, Down syndrome, and other typically developing children. Um, this clinical experience has made me very, very familiar and very comfortable with children of all age ranges, um, impairments, and development, and I really like seeing new children to help myself learn as well as help enhance their lives. Um, I'm CPR certified and have to keep that up to date for my OT program, as well as I was licensed as a babysitter when I was 14 years old. Um, my longest babysitting experience and most consistent was for four years for a family of three children. When I began, the youngest girl was age one, the second youngest girl was age four, and the boy was age five. I stayed overnight with them when the parents would go out. I dropped and picked them off from school and different activities, helped them with their homework, and really acted as kind of an older sister um, to them. I still keep in touch while I'm at college, and I really did form a nice bond with that family, and I'm looking to have that with another family now in this stage of my life. I also babysat sporadically throughout the past seven years for many different families. When I'm not babysitting, my biggest hobbies include reading, running, music, and artwork. I'm currently training for my first half marathon, which will be in April um, in Central Park. It's a run for breast cancer, so that is one of my main focuses right now, is training for that marathon. Um, I also sing and play the piano. I speak French, and I've tutored French in the past, and I also enjoy doing artwork and sketching in my free time. Also, with my Quinnipiac courses, I try and balance work and play, and I do have a very active social life and like to do a lot of interaction with other people. I really hope this video gave you a better sense about me, and I would love to hear from you soon and would look forward to having any experience with children who want to have a fun and enthusiastic babysitter who really does have their well-being at heart. Thank you.